everybody i'm back in the car and back on a dash it is tuesday april 16th and i what the hell gopro oh my god i had to stop my car to get you listen i cleaned my car yesterday and i i, arm, I armor armored like all the surfaces and i vacuums and I'm thinking maybe I shouldn't have because maybe I have made this too slippy, too slippery for the GoPro. Oh boy. Oh boy. All right, let's hope that's not the case. I have already accepted my first order. It's for Jimmy John's. It's $6.09, one point something miles. Um, is this package pickup? I mean, isn't it just picking up food? Why would it say package pickup? Anyways, anyways, so I'm out here today gonna do a dinner shift on a Tuesday night and hopefully it's a good one, we'll see. Um, I wanted to talk real quick about um, another comment I received on, this one was on my live and it was after the fact, not during the live, um, but someone said that they had been watching my videos for a long time and they watched my videos at first because I was genuine and whatever um, but now they don't they don't feel like that anymore because I don't dash as much as I used to oh my god now you're not even looking at me oh, <laughs> oh. This is not gonna work. Oh! <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> and now I'm gonna cry. Oh, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> right in the back okay I'm trying not to cry like does it does it look real greasy on there okay I'm gonna have to try to like wipe it down with some napkins so maybe it won't be so slippery Ugh. oh let me take a drink I've never picked up from Jimmy John's before like ever I didn't even know that we did oh thank you For Uber Eats. Oh, okay. I've got Anthony D. Sure. Alright, awesome. Get the drinks in there, you just gotta get the drinks in there. They have to the drinks on the label. Okay, got it. Alright, I picked it up. Um, the bag is not sealed, and I had to make the drink myself. Let me get the bag put away, and um, let me wipe down the uh, the thing to get some of that armor all off. All right, so I have wiped down <laughs> the dash, and I'm I'm hoping that solves the problem of the slipperiness. I even put some water on there and dried it off, so hopefully we're good. Is it coming from behind us? Oh, it is. Oh, they're going on the other side of the street. Are they? Oh, no, they're coming through. All right. Watch out! Another one? Yep, another one. You're welcome. You have a great day. You too. Yeah. Three dollars, 5.2 miles, four Panera bread, not taking it. Let me see. Ten dollars, nine cents, 3.1 miles, 13 items to shop at Winn-Dixie. No. If I didn't mention it, I started at 345 
and it is 4.10. That first order took a lot longer than I expected it to take. $19.19, 16.2 miles, two orders, Bob Evans. Not taking it. All right, $4, 1.7 miles for Sub-Zero nitrogen ice cream, which is right over there. You can't see it because the trees, but it is. I'm going to accept it because it is $2 per mile. And turn off the oops. There we go, my friends. All right, let's go pick it up. Maybe today will be... And I've never picked up from this place either. So like maybe today will be like the day of picking up from all the places I've never picked up from before. Hi, I'm picking up for um, Ashley H. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You too. Your destination is on the left. I'm looking. The customer requested you leave the order at their door. Is this all one house? They added the following instructions. I think so. Leave at my door. Please do not ring doorbell. No problem. Oh, you know what? I should just, I just, why did I go past the sidewalk? Duh. Alrighty. Here we go, give them their ice cream. I hope it's not too melty. It's like 89 degrees out here right now. But I did put it in the bag. So, hopefully it's still good. Two dollars. 68 cents, 4.1 miles for Applebee's. Not taking it. Two orders, 8.54.2 miles, CD Roma's on DoorDash. And then, come on, hurry up. $7.21, six miles. No, I'm going with the CD Roma's. 854.2 miles CD Romas everybody so anyways um, oh my gosh how much battery do I have 12 that battery is about to die but I'm trying to I'm trying to suck up as much battery as I can because I forgot to charge them before I came out here today so I only have one fully charged and then I have two charging now anyways so what I was trying to talk to you about at the beginning of the video was the comment that I, a comment I had received on my live. This person commented after the fact, um, not during the live. They said that they had uh, been watching my videos for some time. Um, they watched my videos because I was genuine and something. Um, but they said, now it seems like all I do is complain and decline orders and I don't work as many uh, hours as I used to and that it doesn't... Oh, Lord. Don't slide, don't slide, don't slide. Don't slide, I have to turn so slow, people hate me. Oh, oh and it's a cop too. Turn Whoops. Right, then turn left. Well, at least, at least like, I wasn't going fast, right? City of Gulfport? Buddy, what you doing over here? You are in the wrong place. Oh, bro. We're just about to drop off over here. And it's, um, it's a hand it to me. Oh, they're already at the door, too. All right, I'll be right back. Complete delivery. Confirm. 50 tip. Let me turn the oops back on. There's a nice one. Twelve dollars seven cents. Six point one miles for Zico's. I am accepting. Hi, I'm picking up for Mike M. Pretty odd. 
with the name of that road then. We'll see. Which way do you want me to go? Right on 54th. So I need to go that way. All right, this is back here in a gated community. I had to get through the officer, give them my driver's license. And now we're heading back. I have delivered back here before. Um, I still don't recognize the street name though. In a quarter mile, turn left on Coconut Pond Circle Northeast. Turning you around that way. So you can see this gorgeous neighborhood. My dash ended at, let me dash till 6.30 now. And still have the oobs on, it's beautiful back here. Look at these houses. So beautiful, so manicured. Is it this way to get out? I think so. $4.05, 7.7 7 miles for Chick-fil-A now. Is it this way or straight? Oh crap, I think I went the wrong way. Let me go this way. I think I'm supposed to go this way. Yeah, because I didn't turn until I got to the street that I was supposed to turn on. sure where I'm supposed to go right now at this moment. I don't remember which way I came. First Street North. I'm just gonna go straight. Five dollars and 25 cents, 4.6 miles for the fresh market to shop to shop for 16 items. You must be crazy. Nine dollars, 3.7 miles for PDQ. I will take it. Ten minutes away it's uh, someone wants me to meet them in the lobby um, of some boutique and the tea is hot it, like it's warm it's not it's not chilled it's not cold like is that how they usually do it because it's like a half gallon you see it's like and it's it's just like room temperature it's not cold at all all right it's on Central Avenue which is a big bummer. So I hope there's gonna be parking. Anywhere, on the left. Your destination is on the left. What is it, 95? The customer requested you hand them the order. Oh, I see it's that thing right there. They added the following instructions. Hand it to me, we'll meet in the lobby. Okay, but I gotta like make a U-turn so everybody don't get mad. I gotta go around like this. I think there is a spot, um, I've actually parked in it before, sorry for the sun. It's like a loading zone, yep. Loading zone. Oh, it says valet only. Well, too bad, here I am. Can I turn? 
six dollars, four point five miles for original flavor, eighteen eighty nine. What the hell is that? But I'm declining it. Eight dollars, two cents, eleven point three miles for Bella Brava. No. And then I'm gonna turn left on First Avenue. Lots of orders over here though. And now I just have a red buffering circle. Isn't that fantastic? 725, 5.6 miles for Ford's garage. Not taking it. $4.75, 5.4 miles for ABC for four items. Not taking it. I'm like, <laughs> I'm hoping that I get a good order so that they can help me like find my way out of here oh I think this might be good if this takes me to 4th Street let's see Shush. Oh, I don't think this takes me to 4th Street $2 3.1 miles no that's 8th Street okay I'm gonna um, actually get on the interstate here 1775 for 10.4 miles. Chili's taking it to the tip. Not taking it. Well, I'm sitting in this spot long enough, not getting any good orders. So I'm going to head over closer to the mall to see if that helps. Um, it just seems uh, like it's not too good today. You know, and the fact that DoorDash is only letting me schedule like an hour or less at a time would lead me to believe that there's like just too many dashers out right now. Five dollars, 26 cents, 3.8 miles for Starbucks, not taking that. Six dollars, 2.5 miles for Chipotle, I will take that one. Should I even bother to look at the other one? Let me see. Seven for 5.3, so I don't want that. Taking the oops, six dollars, 2.5 miles. Declining the seven dollar, 5.3 mile Chick-fil-A. That customer requested that I text them. So they said, don't knock, text when you deliver. Why? I don't, I don't understand that. $13.25, 7.3 miles uh, for our units at ABC. Oh, you know, that's pretty close. That's pretty close to the two mile. Thing, your or $2 per mile. Fine wine and spirits, Tyrone Square. I'll accept it. But I don't, under I don't understand, like, you know, why, why do I have to text you separate? Does, does, does Uber Eats not notify them when the order's been dropped off? You know, like, why am I typing in the little box after I deliver? the message of where I left it. Do you know what I mean? Why did they request that? Right on Pasadena Avenue South. They need two texts. Don't make no sense. I feel like I just delivered here. 
seven dollars four cents seven point four miles for firehouse subs no no drop off on the right oh my god i is this the same people i just y'all remind me what did i just drop off to these people it's the one where i said that i that i there's no parking so i park drop on, the off on the right corner the gopro battery GoPro battery died just as I was pulling up over there. So that's the same. I've delivered to that same guy like, I don't know when, last week? Must have been last week. Anyways, though, it's the sun is starting to set. And so I'm going to start heading back because my daughter is going to the zoo tomorrow with her great grandparents. And am I going the right way? Yas? Why are you sitting there for? What you doing? Um, and so I'm gonna get home so she has enough time to shower because they're picking them picking her up kind of early. And um, is that the way out? Oh, I think I just missed the way out. No, this is the way out. These places, I swear. Nope, this ain't the way out. I missed it. Let me turn around. Um, but anyway, so I want to get home so she has time to shower and we can, um, you know, get her things together for her. She's going to take the camera so she can get some good pictures of some animals and things like that. And, um, yeah. Yeah, y'all. So, let's head back. If I get something good, I'll take it. You know how it goes. If I don't, then I won't and I'm done. Welcome to the outro. Let us look at everything. So on the oops, I am waiting on the last tip to come in from the alcohol delivery that hasn't come in yet. So we are only up to $31.37 on Uber Eats. If we go ahead and look at DoorDash, DoorDash, there were three dashes, $4.00. Uh, eight fifty and nine dollars, all from today, and that equals twenty one dollars and fifty cents. So if we add together what we have so far, that's going to bring us to fifty two dollars and eighty seven cents. I was dashing for three and a half hours, and so so far the hourly rate is fifteen dollars and ten cents per hour, and my miles were forty eight. So, oh, I, I always forget to, to show you the, the um, acceptance rates. Not a, not a very busy day today. My phone was quiet a lot of the time, and of course there were lots of bad orders. Not very many good orders today, so. But it's, it's a Tuesday, and I think there were a lot of dashers out today. Now we're just getting a white screen. Oh, no, there it goes. 14% acceptance rate, so that did drop. I think I was at like 17 or 18 before. And then on the oobs, it is 17%, and I think that went up from 16. That's all I have for you today. Um, I'm keen to get out of this parking lot. Like, I don't really like this parking lot. You know what I'm saying? And I'm about to go home. All right, everybody. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you will like, subscribe, and share. I can't pull out. Hold on. There's people walking. There they go. Oh, he couldn't get in because she had the keys. Yep, that's a problem. All right, everybody. I hope that you guys had more luck dashing than I did today. And uh, I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.